Man, one of your constituents, Alex De Jesus, was shot dead by Ware Police Department. Have you raised any concerns about that? This Ridley Report is brought to you by Libertania.com. Man, one of your constituents, Alex De Jesus, was shot dead by Ware Police Department. Have you raised any concerns about that? He wasn't even armed or committing a victim crime. Do you care? Ms. Staub, is that you? Are you in the studio? Ms. Staub, is that you? I guess that's Kathy Staub, she's on the school board. Question for you, did you advocate you know, shining less attention on lice than is currently being shown? Hey guys. To the empire for which it stands, one nation under fraud, completely visible, is buying and lying to all. instead of having school on those two holidays where we're paying for staff uh, through their vacation days, uh, it's the possibility of turning the April vacation instead of a full week off into an, ex uh, an extra long weekend where we give the students either Wednesday through Sunday or Thursday through Sunday and we can recapture those two days or we can recapture even a third day. Your Honor, you don't let any of the No, but I think it's for you. But your speaking you are over me. Wait a minute. We've I already taken a, taken a vote. The, 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 you're speaking yeah. over a board member. You would call us good if we did that to you. I think it's worthwhile for the board to consider shortening the second vacation week so that it's an extended weekend instead of a full week off. It's going to save the district $60,000 and give us the opportunity for another teacher. Mr. Rokas, what is this about a, a $60,000 calendar change? Is that really what's happening here? If you guys got enough money to do that, uh, why do you have to tax people? Country Called Prohibition. It's the new book in the Libertania series. Follow, or rather watch your children follow, the adventures of Mary Jane as she travels from her free country to a more familiar land known as Prohibition. How would marijuana be treated in a free society? How would its residents voluntarily protect themselves from attack by authoritarian countries? I bet you don't have the perfect answer yet, but your kids might after they read this. A book so non-aggressive, it's probably banned at your local tax school. Libertania.com